Hey guys, welcome to today's video. I'm sorry if I sound a little bit different right now. I just don't know where my microphone is, but it's okay. I just wanted to quickly talk to you guys for a bit before we get on with the tutorial. So Fermu, which is this eyeglasses company, was kind enough to send me a free pair of glasses so that I can review them for you guys. And I'm actually wearing them right now. These are just clear frame glasses with gold detailing on them. I have a coupon code in the description box down below so that you guys can buy one, get one free. So you get two glasses for the price of one, which I think is a really great deal. And if you're like me and you like wearing glasses or you have to wear glasses, then this is for you. So yeah, I'm actually blind, so I need glasses which is why I wear them most of the time. I do occasionally wear contacts, but not that often. Um, these glasses are great. They are very good quality. They were very affordable. I think these were like $20 on their website. They came in this little case right here, which just has like a map and it's like, I don't know, I think it's really cute. Um, it also came with like a cloth, but I lost that. Um, but anyways, yeah, these glasses are really good quality. Um, I'm wearing them right now. You can look at them if you want. Uh, they fit my face pretty well, I think. They actually have this little thing on their website where you can like upload a picture of yourself and you can get an idea of what the glasses will look like on you. I mean, it's definitely not the most accurate thing in the world, but it's something. These glasses took about two weeks to come in, which is a pretty long time, but that's how long the website said that they would take. So they were pretty transparent about how long the glasses would take to come in. If you guys don't like these glasses, that's fine. They have hundreds of other styles and they are all like pretty like pretty cheap I'd say so yeah I think their most expensive glasses are like 40 or 50 dollars which is not a lot of money at all um, especially compared to like standard glasses like if you go into like lens crafters and you get a pair of glasses there those glasses can easily cost you like over a hundred dollars probably like two hundred dollars so yeah if you are in need of a new pair of glasses Fermu's got you, I got you, you can use my coupon code and you can get two pairs of glasses instead of one. So yeah, if you guys want to stick around for this tutorial, then just keep on watching and yeah, let's begin. So I'm starting off with my bare naked face and my glasses just so you guys can see what the glasses look like on my face without makeup on. And the first thing I'm going to do is prime my face and apply sunscreen. Always apply sunscreen, never forget, super important. Um, I'm actually just mixing the two on my hand and then applying them to my face. I'm using the e.l.f. Hydrating Primer and the Bare Republic Mineral Sunscreen in SPF 30. For my coverage, I'm going to go in with my Beyond CC Cream. Um, if I had a matte foundation, I would use that instead, um, just because I find that with glasses, they can slip off your face if, I guess if your face is like too dewy. So if you guys have a more matte foundation, then use that instead. Next, I'm going to go in with my NYX HD Concealer. This will just brighten the area under my eyes, which can be emphasized by your glasses. Um, it can make like shadows under your eyes and make your under eye circles appear much darker than they really are. Next, I'm going to mattify everything with my RCMA No Color Powder. If you are wearing glasses, I would highly recommend using a finishing powder. It can avoid the slipping of your glasses that happens if your face is a bit too um, dewy. Now I'm going to go in with brows. First, I'm just underlining the shape of my brows, then I'm going to fill in all the extra hairs. 
And then I'm going to soften everything up by brushing it out and giving it a softer, more natural look. Next, I'm going to go in with an eyeshadow primer. Um, this will really help your eyeshadows stand out. For my eyeshadow, I'm just going in with my new Too Faced Natural Love palette and I'm going in with the color Fairy Tale and I'm just applying that all across my lid and under my eye as well. Next, I'm going to go in with the shade Heaven and I'm just going to apply that to the bottom of my lid. Now for liner, I would usually do a black wing liner but I wanted this to be a more natural look. So I'm going to go in with my... Um, so I'm actually going to use eyeshadow as eyeliner. I'm just going to wet my brush and then I'm going to use the shade Makeup and Chill. After that, I'm going to tight line my eyes. I'm using the Wet n Wild Mega Last Retractable um, Liner in brown. For mascara, I'm using the Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara. If you don't have naturally curled lashes like me, then I would highly recommend curling your lashes before so that um, your glasses are not actually touching your lenses when you're wearing your glasses. I'm also going to go in with Heaven at the top of my brow bone and the corner of my eye just to brighten up the look. For contour, I'm just going to go in with my Wet n Wild Mega Glow Contour Stick and I'm going to be contouring my nose, my forehead, and underneath of my jaw. Taking my Mega Glow um, highlighter stick, I'm going to highlight the bridge of my nose and I'm also going to highlight the area around my forehead and my cheekbone. To finish off the look, I'm going to go in with my Milani Color Statement Lipstick in Coral Addict. I really like um, orange tones lipsticks because I think that they complement my skin really well. And that's the finished look. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please leave a like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!